internet it is Sunday the 1st of May 2016 first day of May and it is super warm I'm heading down to Barangaroo there's a brand new man-made parklands headlands area right at Barangaroo and I've checked out on my compass it faces well it faces many ways but it also faces west which is that way so that means there's gonna be a sunset over water and you know me, for I'm a sucker for sunsets on water. Gonna meet Marty. It's also NSD today. Well, it has been for a few days, but this is, um, am I far enough back to see this? This is a guy called Peter Bibby, and his band is called Peter Bibby and his Bottles of Confidence. Singer-songwriter from Perth. I got sent his album, Beautician, Hairstylist, something else it's a three word title i can't remember it i'll flick it up on screen you can have a look at it but i got sent this album to my music website across the ocean this one in particular stood out this guy is a really really cool songwriter most of his songs are about drinking and boozing and that resonates with me i've actually seen him and photographed him three times i'll show you some pictures then we'll head down here to barangaroo and uh you know what i've got in there Homebrew! This is the new Barangaroo Headland Reserve. It's all brand new. It's, it's practically only been open for a few months. The way it works is this whole peninsula used to be, I think it used to be like an old dock and it was just like left to nothing. And now they've made this whole parkland, all these sandstone rocks. So you can either be down on the water level or you can go up to this top bit via a set of stairs, which I'll just do now. That's the top. Get some pretty spectacular views of that hideous tower. Some port authority, but over there, that's the view you want. The Sydney Harbour Bridge. Oh, guy taking a photo. Sorry, dude. They were taking photos. With a beautiful background like that, why wouldn't you take a photo? Now I'm gonna head back down, have a beer with Marty. Marty's joining us. He's on his way here. I'm having a home brew before he gets here. Sneaky one. So while I sit here and wait for Marty to turn up, because he's taking his, his time, I happen to notice, and you probably did as well, there's water in front of me. A friend of mine gave me a wine bottle. So you know what's happening. It's message in a bottle part six. I think this is number, f this is either number five or six. But either way, this is gonna be the hardest one I've ever done because it means I'm gonna have to throw a wine bottle into the Sydney Harbour, and that really kills me. I, I, I don't feel at all comfortable with this, but, for science. So here's my note that I've written. I've got the date, the 1st of the 5th, 16. Hello stranger. My name is Benon Julius William Otto Kirpsch and I make YouTube videos. I have a channel called Gives a Minute where I vlog my daily existence. On this particular occasion, in brackets, and consequently in this episode, close brackets, I have written this note and put it in a bottle and thrown it into the Sydney Harbour from the new Barangaroo headland on May the 1st, which is where I am right now. Um, if you find it, please get in touch via my YouTube page. Search for Gives a Minute. I would very much like to see where this note is found. P.S. I'm sorry for the messy writing. I wrote this literally on the rocks at Barangaroo. Thanks. Have a tops day. Ben on XOX. There's my sketchy handwriting. Even that, that's, that's even bad for my likings. But I did write on a rock, so. Now the only thing I've got to do now, like always, is pop this in the bottle and lob it into the water. Sorry, Sydney Harbour. This really kills me to do this, but it is all in the name of social science. 
a friend told me that it's not science, it's more social science. Feels like littering. It's Darling Harbour in there. That bottle's probably going to head into Darling Harbour. <laughs> it's, probably, it's probably only going to wind up in Darling Harbour. But wouldn't that be funny if someone found it? And I made all this trouble and all this effort and it was just picked up a kilometre down that way. Marty! Hey. How are you, man? Good. How you doing? Good, dude. Oh, what are you doing <laughs> under your thumb? Ah, oh, it's a scissor. Yeah. Scissor cut. Hey, check this out. Before you got here, I did a message in the bottle. As if to taunt me and mock me for littering into my own harbour, the bottle is still sitting right in front of where we are and it's been floating around for like... And an octopus grabbed his an, GoPro. An hour and a half. Look at this. It's, still, it's right there. It looks like that there's a there's a park parkland park top. Up yeah, there. yeah. There's like a um, stargazing. Just just area. up where that torch is, that, that <laughs> giant torch. That's the only hideous thing in this new yeah, area. Well, that's been here the whole time. It's a little watchtower, right? Yeah, yeah watchtower. Hey, there's so, a... so P8 is just around the bend. That's where right. we went. Like, did you walk that way? I did. Yeah, I walked. This he, way. He, he walked this there, way. There was two musical references there. He said a watchtower, and he said walk this way. That's like. You could have hit Jimmy and you could have hit uh, Run DMC. Barangaroo Headland Reserve, that was awesome. Great place. Faces west, you can see a sunset. Beautiful place. You just saw what we saw. It was amazing. One of the other best parts about it is that when you walk back, you get to come over underneath the Harbour Bridge here, which is this big structure behind me. Sydney Harbour Bridge, they really thought hard about the naming. It's in Sydney, it goes over a harbour and it's a bridge. They nailed it. Marty and I were just down the way, we were talking to a backpacker or a group of backpackers and they were saying that they found a bar just five metres from here and they have in the bar there's a miniature harbour bridge and a miniature opera house and the actual harbour is made of vodka and what they do is they put it on an angle and when you, at the end of it, you actually drink the vodka Sounds a little bit tacky, but I'm keen. Do you oh, I like it vodka, out? yeah. I'm in for this, yeah. He loves and vodka. then we'll swim in the harbour. I say we check it out. Yeah, let's definitely do it. Let's see let's go. Oh, that's, so, um, we're, we're out of time. Now that that's finished, there's a few things that you can do. First, you can subscribe to my channel here. Then, you can check out the previous minute here. Check out a random minute here. Or check out the first minute here. And if you're a photographer like I am, you might want to check out my Lightroom 6 presets here.